A number of Iowans are receiving notice of a potential data breach at a central Iowa medical clinic. KCCI's Ethan Humble learned that some patients say they should have been told sooner. Ethan. Yes, Stacy. Des Moines orthopedic surgeons, better known as DMOS, sent letters telling patients their personal information might have been accessed on or around February of last year. It's led to frustrations with the people I've heard from just getting notice last week. They should have been more forthcoming. They knew when it happened. Des Moines Orthopedic Surgeons, better known as DMOS, is letting its patients know of a possible data breach on their personal information. And with the letter stating the incident happened on or around February of last year, patients like Katherine Smith say the letter last week came too late. Why did it take a whole year for you to figure out that you'd had it and to inform your patients that their information might have been taken. In the letters, DMOS says it notified the FBI of the potential breach and discovered the unauthorized removal of patient files in December, then leading to the January mailings. They also tell recipients what they can do to protect their personal information, like placing fraud alerts and security freezes on their credit files. Why do I have to take all the proactiveness? You know what information, they know what information was taken and they know whose information was taken. As of the letter's release, DMOS says there's no evidence that any information has been used for fraud or identity theft. But if it was, patients' full names, addresses, date of birth, state ID, driver's license, and medical and health insurance information may have been leaked in the breach. Now I gotta worry about whether or not somebody's got my identity again, and it's not fair. And for Smith, it's led to some doubt in the company she once had confidence in. I used to trust DMOS. I'm not so sure that they're what I trust anymore. And we reached out to Des Moines Orthopedic Surgeons today about this letter and the possible data breach, but we are still waiting to hear back. Stacy. Thank you, Ethan. And if you think you were affected by a data breach, cybersecurity experts say there are some things that you can consider. You can freeze your credit. That prevents new accounts from being opened in your name. Sign up for fraud alerts and credit monitoring from any of the big three credit reporting agencies. You can also purchase identity theft protection. The Federal Trade Commission encourages people to go on identitytheft.gov if your information is lost or stolen.